In 1893, the historian Frederick Jackson Turner presented a now famous paper called The Significance of the Frontier in American History to the American Historical Association in Chicago. In it, he propounded what is now called the Frontier Thesis. Basically, Turner said American rugged independence was the product of intense interaction between civilized urbanity and the uncivilized wilderness, or the frontier as he called it. It was a clever notion in that it seemed to explain why Americans were different than Europeans. It was also something of a warning. For Jackson was in essence saying, the frontier made us what we are, and now the frontier is closing, so we may just become something else. He was not wrong. But really, Americans had already become something else. Consider this photograph taken by Andrew J. Russell on May 10, 1869, at Promontory Point, Utah. It depicts a celebration held at the completion of the Transcontinental Railroad. Even though it was taken almost a quarter century before Turner issued his thesis, the photo shows the American frontier closing and the effects it was already having on the American character. Turner's Americans were spontaneous, but there is nothing spontaneous about this photo. It was clearly staged, probably for commercial purposes. You can almost see the photographer Russell saying, You fellas move over there. Now you two shake hands. Hold that bottle of champagne up. A little higher. Turner's Americans were self-sufficient, but the people in this photo are the employees of a huge continent-spanning corporate machine. They are cogs, as one senses from the remarkable similarity of their attire. Turner's Americans were unpretentious, but this photo itself is a testament to pretension. The people in it are laying claim to something that is not theirs, a continent full of indigenous Americans. The natives, of course, are out of the picture, and soon enough they will be swept out of the way and into far-off reservations. Ironically enough, one of the primary instruments of their eventual destruction, alcohol, gets pride of place in the photo. Russell called his picture East and West Shaking Hands at the Laying of the Last Rail. But he might well have called it The New Americans.